Hello, my friends. This is Ford, and I'm here because somebody, aka Jim Ward, says that I never cook. So I'm making this, and Jim Ward will not be able to have any. How about that? <laughs> anyway, this is Paul Ward, aka Tutu Fit Mama, and we are burning down the house today. Um, unfortunately, I don't need people to help me here, so I'll have to work with the camera a little bit. Um, a couple weeks, I think two weeks ago, I posted a salad to make for baseball. Um, and finally today I had the stuff to buy it and try it. It's called watermelon, cucumber, lime, and chili salad. Um, I know a lot of times you think you just grab the watermelon and eat a whole. I think my kids have eaten two watermelons this week. So here we are. Um, I'm going to take these. This is four cups of watermelon. And I, I did it in like little balls because it was just easier. Um, and you'll see, I did some of the cutting ahead of time, because I'm sure you don't want to sit there and watch me cut it all afternoon. Hello, Pam. Hello, Carol. So I chopped up. That was a whole cucumber and peeled it. It was supposed to be half, but I don't know. I'm not one for following recipes. It makes my sister crazy. Um, that's two tablespoons of fresh mint, and I'm going to actually um, juice those limes. I've got this awesome juicer. Um, I, I got it at, um, I think I got it at Walmart. But I've seen them at other grocery stores. There's actually three different sizes. This is for um, oranges. There's one for lemons. There's one for limes. I suggest if you just want to buy one, you can get the whole set. But buy the biggest one, and it actually works in all three of them. But I will say to you that this juicer works fantastically. Um, you basically put it in like this. Squeeze it. And everything runs out. Include, and there's no seeds at all. Um, it calls for, uh, let's see here, three tablespoons, so I'm going to do about three limes. And when it's done, it literally, there's nothing, there's nothing left in there. I saw this on a cooking show, and afterwards I was like, I have to have these. And it has been one of those, I have tons of gadgets, but i got to say it's one of my most favorite purchases. So in here goes the um, fresh, the fresh lime juice. Ooh, that smells good. Makes me want a margarita. I'm telling you, Pam, this juicer is awesome. But like I said, you really only need just the one. You don't actually need three of them uh, for each size of, um, like I said, I think this is one for the orange. But like I said, I'm using limes, and it's working pretty good. Um, you can throw them in the washing machine, and they do pretty good. I think I have a smaller one, too, but um, that's, I don't know. I don't know what I did with it. Jim Ward likes to hide all my equipment. So that, three tablespoons of lime juice. I'm gonna add in um, a tablespoon of olive oil. I, I hate this container, it annoys the crud out of me. But it's what he bought, so I gotta work with it. Um, I tend to actually like to use uh, grapeseed oil, but this is the end of it, so I will use it. And it, uh, it is a tablespoon of olive oil. Um, quarter of salt. I don't ever measure it. I like the Himalayan salt. Um, so I'll just give it a couple cranks. I'll taste the salad after I make it and kind of add as I go. Again, I'm horrible at following directions. But I will post up the recipe again for you guys. Um, half a teaspoon of chili powder. Um, this is hot. I thought all chili powder is hot. I don't know if anybody knows, but um, we'll see how it goes. This I will not go crazy on. I will only put the recommended amount in. Because um, I don't know how hot it's going to be. Basically, you add everything in. Lime juice, got it. I'll add in the mint. Got it. Um, salt and chili powder and whisk to blend. I will do that. Hang on. Um, I, I figured today it was beautiful out and I would make a salad. Last week when it was 50 and raining, who wanted to eat a watermelon salad, let's be honest. So I will mix, I will whisk it up. It smells awesome. Um, there's that. Okay. Basically put the watermelon, cucumber, and cheese. So I got my watermelon right here. I will add in my cucumber. And extra water, I forgot that one. And then um, two thirds cup of feta. All right, I added two, or a, th a third cup of, but I added a little bit more. Seems silly to put it back in there. Um, 
basically you just drizzle salad evenly, toss it. Um, I like this container because I can basically just close it and, and shake it up. Um, and that is it. If you would, I will let you know how it is. I may have to add a little bit more chili powder, but what I will add that in separately as I go. Um, let me mix that in. And I'll let you know how it is. If you have any questions, please post up. Um, I don't know if anybody's ever made the salad before, but I'm not a huge watermelon fan because I hate when I open it and then um, it tastes horrible. Um, but lately the watermelons, I have to say, have been pretty good. Um, so I will mix this up. And I'll probably throw a little bit of water, a little bit of it on top. I will try it for you, let you know. Get a little bit of watermelon, a little bit of feta. That's good. And I really can't taste the chili powder, so I may actually add another teaspoon in. I'll let this sit for probably about an hour. It's going to be awesome. Thank you for joining me. I will show you what it looks like. This is what it looks like all mixed up. How awesome is that? Can I get a picture of that? Yeah, oh well. Wrong way. So that's it. So that's my cucumber, watermelon, feta salad, or chili salad. Um, and like I said, there's mint in there. So I hope you try to make this. I hope you enjoy this. Um, this would be a nice salad to either bring to parties. Um, I may bring it on Sunday to me. I have a baseball party. Maybe, I don't know, but it's good. Have a great day, and I hope this helps you and your family live your best life. And hey, the thing about it is, especially with my burning down house, is there's no way I activate the fire alarm. So I can make this, and nothing gets on fire. So we'll see how it goes. Have a great day. Enjoy the sun. Um, in New England and have a great weekend.